Hello, my name is Erica Barr, and I am the director of the Community College Program here at the National Institutes of Health in the Office of Intramural Training and Education. Today I would like to talk to you about the Community College Summer Enrichment Program. The goal of this program is to give community college students an opportunity to conduct research here at the NIH as summer interns. Now, before I begin, many of you may have viewed the Applying to the NIH Summer Internship Program by Dr. Sharon Milgram. And so there will be some similarities in how to have a successful application. However, there are differences in terms of the application review process and how you are actually matched to a research mentor. There are three components to the Community College Summer Enrichment Program. The first component is the research component, which allows community college students to work alongside a research mentor and participate in the host laboratory activities. The other component is the science skills education and career development. All participants of CSEP will have the opportunity to attend a one-week orientation. During this orientation, you participate in various workshops which increase your science skills such as laboratory math, how to keep a lab notebook, and laboratory culture 101. You also have the opportunity to talk to career counselors to discuss your career goals and how to accomplish those goals. The third component of CSEP is mentorship. All participants are matched with a CSEP mentor to talk to weekly about your experiences and how to make sure that you have a successful summer. The CSEP eligibility requirements are that you be a part-time or four-time community college student, that you have a 3.0 GPA or above, that you've taken two or more science-related or biology courses, that your major is in the science or health related field. You should be a U.S. citizen or permanent resident and have a strong interest in gaining research experience. Uh, unlike many other programs, there is no prior research experience required. If you are in a dual program, um, as far as in an advanced high school or in a transfer four-year college university program, you are ineligible. The CSEP application opens mid-November and the deadline is in late January, so there's a very short application cycle. The application is online and it includes information such as the general contact information. You should list your relevant courseworks and grades, resume, two letters of recommendation, and also a cover letter. Please state in your cover letter that you are applying to CSEP. You also will have the opportunity to indicate CSEP in the preferred institute option in the application. As I stated earlier, there are differences between the Community College Summer Enrichment Program application process and the general NIH Summer Internship Program. With CSEP, the applications are reviewed by a committee. The committee will look at three criteria. The first criteria is your academic success. We will look at your performance in your math and science courses. Uh, also, the other criterion includes your reference letters. You want to make sure that you have strong reference letters from your math and or science instructors. Finally, you should have a really good cover letter. In your cover letter, you should include why you're interested in CSEP, what are your research interests, what are your educational and career goals, and how you feel this research experience at the NIH will contribute to your goals. All selected applicants will be contacted in February. Following the selection process, CSEP participants will be matched with a research mentor by a review committee based on your research interests. Please make note that if you are applying to CSEP, you do not have to directly contact investigators. Someone will work with you closely to ensure that you are placed in the lab based on your research interests. 
If you would like additional information, please feel free to contact me at erica.bar at nih.gov. I would also like to encourage you to view the Applying to NIH Summer Internships video by Dr. Sharon Milgram for additional information on how to have a successful application. Thank you.